looks like Moltres is gonna be the one that is gonna be stinky and give us no hits apart from oh my god holy Woo -hoo -hoo. hello ladies and gentlemen I'm how does this in today's video I'm gonna be opening a set of the new Clan Zenith Valerian Legendary Bird Big Tins this is newest product to be released for Clan Zenith so we both first this will be a do let's get it all right guys so here we are here is one of the big pins the galarian articuno here is the back legendary pokemon from galar charging to battle here is the galarian zapdos and it has the same on the back as well legendary pokemon from galar charging to battle so i think they're all gonna have the same on the back and here is the Moltres. Alright, so let me crack all of these open and I'll be right back. So here are your cold cards for the three big tins. Galarian Articuno, Galarian Zapdos and Galarian Moltres. Here is your Galarian Articuno promo card. And you get five packs in each tin so one two three four five that's the galarian otakuno packs right there so i'll leave them right there here is your galarian zapdos promo card and here is your galarian modress promo card Alright, so there's your free promos guys right there on the top. I separated them to the packs that they came in as well. So let's see which one's gonna do the best. My favorite out of the promos, I think, has to be the Galarian Moltres. I think Moltres is my favorite legendary bird anyway. But the Articuno is actually quite nice though still. I don't know which one. Definitely not the Zapdos. I think the Zapdos is my least favorite. But between the Moltres and the Articuno. <laughs> close, close, close. I'm gonna go with Moltres. But let's start with Articuno. Let's see if Articuno is going to give us the hits. Let me know in the comments down below as well, guys, which one's your favorite legendary bird or the Galarian form of the legendary bird. Three, four from the back. Are we going to get first pack magic? Water energy, Salazzle, Rick Candy, Dusclops, Helioptile, Scrub, Robin, Furloin, Slandit. Let's go! First pack magic, but it's a full hot plant which I've already got. Oh man. And uh hollow bay, which do I need bay? I'm not too sure. Alright, so we've got first pack magic from Articuno, nice, but it's a card that I already got, so that's a bummer. See, that could have been, that would have been well nice if it was anything else. Well nice. Damn it. Could have been a Pokemon. Any Pokemon I would have taken that I haven't got actually for the Master Set. Look at Top, Ponyard, Yanma, Shatot, Reverse Lycan Rock. Let's yes! Go! Wow, double banger. No, not double banger. Um, two for two guys in Articuno so far. Full Art Lightning Energy. Perfect for the Master Set. Articuno's doing us good so far. Articuno's doing us good so far. 3 for 2. And these packs are hard to open. Are we going to get 3 for 3? Oh my days. I see something peeking here, guys. I see something peeking. 3 for 3, guys. 3 for 3. Hopefully, it's something that I need. Please be something that I need. The monster set. Bishop. Bavlar. Pokemon Catcher. Rockruff. Snow Run. Hancham. Shinx. Is it this one? What? what? Wait, no friggin' way. Oh my days. Third one. My third. Jeez, jeez, jeez. Wait, Lord.
Mm. Before we get into the fourth pack, three for three, guys. In Articuno, Articuno is gonna smash this. I think Articuno's hands down already won. But I've pulled the most expensive card three times, guys. Three times. I can't believe. It. Uh, I'm happy because technically I can just trade it off, and then when it comes to buying singles, which I won't be doing until after May, which is which I believe should be the last time or the last month for the last products for crown zenith to release once i've opened up all the products that's when i'm going to start going for singles but i guess that giratina can just pay for i guess arceus or one of the other gold cards or even mute v star which i doubt i'm going to pull so wow reverse light pod oranguru last pack for articuna i mean i would take that 100 percent it, it would be nice to pull a different one like I don't know, maybe the Palkia, maybe the Diagon, maybe the Arceus. But even then, pulling three of those, the most expensive, Crown Zenith is doing me good. I mean, I think Crown Zenith in general is doing good for everyone. The hits in Crown Zenith is just crazy. Bidoof, Reverse Lovesta, Snorlax. All right, moving on to Galarian Zapdos, my least favorite of the birds. And I mean, the Galarian ones anyway. Come on, open. In terms of Galarian birds, Zapdos is my least favorite, but um, I would say Zapdos is my second favorite from the originals, Lightning Energy. First is Moltres, then Zapdos, and then Articuno, but in Galarian forms, Zapdos is my least, Yahoo! Radiant Eternatus, nice, and a Zero Aura. All the doubles that I get I'll sleeve at the end of the video guys at the end of the video but yeah what was I saying yeah um the glaring but come on why are these so tough to open now yeah so it's Modrex, Zapdos, Articuno and then glaring form versions Modrex, Articuno, Zapdos no did I just get it wrong in the, it was for the original gen 1 it was Modrex, Articuno no Modrex, Zapdos, Articuno Galarian is Moltres, Articuno, Zapdos. And so far, apart from the Radiant Eternatus, Zapdos is the one doing us 30. Maybe because it's my least favorite one, so it's just like, screw it. Let me not give you nothing since you don't like me. Anyway, there you go. Darkness Energy, Luxio, Dragon Shoes. So, in terms of these products, for once, for some reason, normally in the US, they get the big tins and we get the smaller gift tins. But this time we get. Yahoo! Oh, got that one. Sizzle. This time we get both variants. We get the big tins and the gift tins. Which I don't know why this time around they did it like that. I'm not sure if the US is going to get the gift tins as well, the smaller versions. Um, I think those have four packs. The big ones have five, and then the smaller ones have four. So I don't know why they did it this time. It's crazy. It's different. Are we getting anything out of this one? Reverse. I mean, yeah, reverse rescue carrier. Small X. Yep, looks like Zapdos is going to do us 30. Zapdos is going to do us 30. I mean, we got a Galarian Gallery and a Radiant, but nothing's going to top the full art. Actually, technically, three full arts from Articuno. We got gold energy and a block trainer in the glaring gallery wow amazing amazing Yahoo! another one that i've got in the trainer gallery Let's and a zashian v star yes the one that i need for the master set beautiful saving my favorite and the best for last yeah guys so let me know if you're opening these tins how your luck went with these tins and which of the galarian legendary birds is your favorite even gen 1 if you're a gen 1 knife you're not then that could be different but in terms of your gen 1 
legendary birds which one's your favorite and which one's your favorite are the galarian reverse energy leaf which i already got for corona i just realized something out of like off topic and of my unboxing knife which you won't might not have seen you might have just seen the edge of it like the sharp point peeking out above the webcam and my webcam is going to be my unboxing knife was still open on the side right on my right hand where i could have bloody cut myself or stabbed myself i realized it just then reverse bead yes i believe i need executor scarlet and violet is only two weeks away guys scarlet and violet is only two weeks away i can't wait i actually can't wait a new set new silver borders new um pack layout so no more card trick um what else new rarity kind of pull rates i guess um Yahoo! yes Moltres hasn't really come through three packs in we've only got an um Galarian gallery but we got one that i need for the master set so at least 110 has given me one of each for the master set at least and a ditto yes another one for the master set perfect yeah scarlet and violet new rarity symbols um no more pack trick silver borders you get two reverses and hollow or better so you can literally get two bangers in one pack plus a reverse and then i think it's what three or is it four commons so in terms of master set i think it's going to be easier because of the reverses because you're pulling two reverses each pack and hollows as well it's going to be much easier to collect the like main set of the set i think you get one less common but i think you get one less common same amount of uncommons but two more reverses yeah i think you get one less common so that might make it a little bit harder a little bit harder to collect the commons for the master set but commons again are commons anyway so it's easy looks like Moltres is gonna be the one that is gonna be stinky and give us no hits apart from oh my god holy centering top to bottom is poor but yes last pack magic guys last pack magic we pulled our kiss we start yes i can't believe it i can't believe it this opening was amazing these giftings amazing oh my god wow 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 what a way to end it what a way to end it if only that was a god pack but there you have it guys that was crown zenith valerian legendary birds big tins what a way to end the video and what a way to start the video as well wow so it, hit rates are to zap those one you could say rare i say articuno one this one for sure because i pulled three full arts the gold the lightning energy and the grant and the motres the least hits but the, i would say my best hit because it's a card that i need for the master set and it's arceus Oof. if you guys enjoyed this video as much as i did if you guys stuck with me to the end i'd appreciate if you could leave a like subscribe turn notifications on for more and i'll see you on the next one peace